Right, so question one, 74 times 234 equals 17,316. But it used this information to work out two questions. So it's almost the same question, except my uh, answer, my question is slightly different. The 740 is 10 more times bigger than 740. So what we should realise with that is it's going to put a naught on the end, because if we multiply something by 10, that's precisely what it does. So it's 173160. Uh, next question, 74 times 2.34. Well, this time we've made it uh, smaller, but we've actually made it smaller by two decimal places. Right, so we've come in, um, so we are doing some, so we have to take account of that in the answer and bring it our answer. So we look at 17316. Because the point is moved two across, we'll do the same here, and the answer is 173.16. And that is two marks getting you started on your higher exam paper to a good start.